Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. I'm going out real soon. I got like an hour to spare, so might as well talk about the Minecraft movie teaser trailer that came out a couple days ago. <clears throat> I watched it already once. I'm not going to lie. I already watched it once. But I wanted to rewatch it again and kind of go through it, you know, kind of break it down and see what we missed or whatever. And just talk about certain scenes and basically the stuff that we have right now. So, um... You guys already know, I'm a freaking Minecraft veteran. I've played Minecraft throughout like half my life already, right? I've played that game ever since like the freaking alpha. Ever since like 2009, 2010, I've always played the game. And personally, I like to think that I have the ability and I am, uh, I need to talk about it, you know? I've been playing the game for a hell of a long time. I've played freaking that game for probably, let's say, 5,000 hours across multiple devices from the xbox uh, xbox 360 xbox one xbox series x playstation 3 playstation 4 playstation 5 the wii u nintendo switch the freaking pocket edition before it turned to the minecraft the, you know bedrock edition i played the java edition i played every single version of freaking minecraft even the freaking nintendo 3ds version i played all of them all right i'm a freaking freaking master when it, i'm a freaking god when it comes to minecraft all right you guys already seen my videos before you guys have seen all my builds so i decided to uh might as well talk about it and uh yeah here we go so let's go ahead and start it is that freaking the beatles it just sounds really distorted i forgot what the song of the song of the beatles is uh, called but I can't think of it, I, but I know it's the Beatles. It has to be the Beatles. And also the portal. The portal is uh, blue. Why is it not purple? Are they probably teasing, like, new updates to the game itself? Maybe a new dimension? Finally, maybe? Please, Mojang, give us a new freaking dimension on Minecraft to explore. Please. It's been a while since we had a new dimension. Like, years. I freaking hate hearing that. Step right this way. All right. So, um, if we actually go back to uh, the world over here, uh, I wish they would add like this uh, world to the game, like a seed to like promote the movie. I think that'd be pretty cool. Uh, yeah, I just need like at least ten percent of all you know, you know, royalties and for that idea and stuff like that. That'd be pretty cool for at least for a year. So yeah, promote this uh, world in a seed form into the video game. I think it'd be pretty cool. And we go a little bit forward over there. Uh, this world over here. So I'm guessing this is where all the... Uh, put this in full screen here over here. Full screen time. I think this is where all the labor and love and effort went to making the super duper graphics pack. You guys remember that? The super duper graphics pack that they promised a long ass time ago, back in 2017, 2016 maybe? I'm not really sure. Here it is. In movie form. We got it, finally. Also, look at the perspective here. It looks like they're, this is obviously all green screen. All this right here is green screen towards like where this guy's uh, head is, right over here. This is right here, the wall, and it just goes up. So this, all this right here is a green screen, which is, there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, just ask your favorite Twitch streamer that probably uses a green screen behind them. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I exposed them. My bad. But, yeah, I mean, it's a green screen, whatever. But yeah, it looks really weird because of the perspective. Look, look at this tree, and then look at them. And there's also no shadows. Well, there's some slight shadows. He doesn't have any shadow, barely. But just the perspective. Unless, like, they're going, like, down a hill, whatever, and, like, the tree's just a little bit, like, I don't know, like lower, and then they're up a little bit higher. I mean, that's probably it. I'm not really sure, but anyway, who cares? So here we got our protagonist. Uh, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing in this movie, but I got hired anyway. The I'm a dumb kid. I'm going to be asking a bunch of dumbass questions. I'm a freaking noob when it comes to Minecraft. Probably gets bullied on Minecraft character. We got Mr. Momo over here. He's somehow in the, I don't know, I guess he was like passing by doing some like audition for the Barbie movie last year or some bullshit. And he just stumbled upon the uh, studio where they were filming Minecraft. They're like, hey, fuck it, might as well go in there. 
somehow he got the job and he forgot to you know kind of take off his clothes from the previous movie he was working on and just showed up in that and then we got her that's like she looks really familiar i forgot from where though she kind of looks like this one uh, girl used to go to my school she looks really familiar Oh yeah, you gotta see the portal back there, right there. Why is another portal blue? That makes no sense. Why is it blue? Also, another thing. You guys know how rare it is for a sheep to spawn in in Minecraft. A pink one. You can die. A uh, you can crossbreed. You know, I actually had it ready here for you guys, but look at the chance of a pink. Sheep spawning into the world. I cannot even talk right now. But it's really rare. Extremely rare. But you can crossbreed two regular white sheep and then add like the uh, freaking pink dye on it. But to get a sheep to spawn in like this is really rare. What the hell? The gas looked pretty cool. I like the design that they went with. Uh, yeah, I'll give them that. It looks pretty cool. Also, the piglins. I'm not sure. Oh, yeah. Another thing I wanted to talk about before it kind of goes. Somehow there is gas over the uh, overworld. Somehow they got it through the portal. I'm not sure how exactly that happens. Again, someone let me know how that's possible, especially in survival mode. I know in creative world, obviously, you just throw the egg and it spawns in. But when it comes to, like, Minecraft survival, it is really rare to get a ghast in the overworld. Uh, I don't know how it's even possible. I don't think it's even possible. I've never done it before myself. Because in my all my years of playing Minecraft, that's never happened to me before. Not even on accident. It's, it's just impossible. So we need some explaining here. The wolf looks all right. I'm not really feeling him, I'm being honest. I feel like the back should be a bit more rectangle instead of like this little hump. It looks really weird. It looks like they're trying to do like a camo uh, hybrid of it. I don't know. It's just really weird. I like the sun and the moon. They got that square. The crafting table looks pretty cool. They got an ender pearl over here. They got TNT. They got some leather. All right, we're back. Take off my hat. It was kind of bothering me. It's also really hot in this room. Uh, anyway, where was I? So, uh, yeah, they got Ender Pearl. They got a barrel over here. The crafting table is pretty cool. I wonder if the swords are going to look like that or different. I really hope they change that design. It just looks really odd, really weird. Uh, I really can't tell apart all the, all the other stuff on that shelf over there. But anyway, let's go ahead and move on. The cubes are pretty cool, I guess. Just like in the game, they kind of just float. Uh, here. Steve's Lava Chicken. I just realized that. What is that in the back? The Ever... The Ender Dragon... Pat patio? I'm not sure what this other sign says over here. The creeper looks pretty cool. I like that design. Kind of fluffy though. Looks like a freaking plushie. Anyway, it is what it is. Imagine like a Minecraft horror film. That'd be pretty cool. The nether looks pretty cool. Makes a lot more sense now seeing all these mobs in here. And then you got Jack Black. Who are you? Your mom. I am Steve. 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 Also, you hear like random, like a uh, struck, I don't know, lightning struck or whatever the fuck. I can't even speak English. Just in the background. I guess it's going to start raining after that scene. Okay. This guy is such a tool bag. Such a tool bag.
Someone let me know what Beatles song that is, dude. I can't think. I don't know. It's just... I don't know. <laughs> Got the llama. And, uh... You hear that stupid freaking line. Let's step right this way! <laughs> uh, only in theaters April 4th. I'm gonna go watch it. Obviously, this freaking film is not made for me. I'm a freaking adult. It's made for children. I'm still gonna go watch it, though. Hopefully, it's a fun movie to watch. Uh, other than that... Yeah, we still need that freaking super duper graphics pack. That's all I've learned from this movie trailer is that we need that ASAP in the game. Also, optimize the game for the Series X and PlayStation 5 consoles. And uh, if I had to give this rating, uh, this teaser a rating, I guess, would be like a 5 out of 10. Uh, I don't know. It's just a lot of things don't make sense. Obviously, we'll probably learn more about this uh, movie once it does release and how all the characters ended up meeting up and meeting in this world of well, Minecraft, so, yeah, also, uh, I wanted to apologize in advance for my um, live stream earlier, I forgot I was multi-platform streaming, I live stream on YouTube and Twitch at the same time, though I ended up, I only ended up having my Twitch chat up, and I did not end up having my YouTube, twi uh, YouTube twat, you might as well cancel me. Where? What the hell am I saying? I forgot to have my YouTube uh, chat on, and uh, <laughs> YouTube chat on. And usually I put it like on this uh, other tablet, and I read both chats at the same time. But I did not end up doing that until like I finally finished the freaking live stream. I was like, oh crap! I was like, damn it! I forgot I was also live streaming on freaking YouTube because I obviously when you live stream on Twitch. It doesn't automatically upload to YouTube. You have to do it manually through the settings and whatever. So that's why I live stream on both and kind of grow two audiences at the same time. Anyway, I wanted to apologize in advance and, uh, yeah, just say that. Other than that, if you guys enjoyed today's video and you guys want to see more reactions and all that stuff, let me know. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, other than that, I'm go run some errands, I guess, and edit this video together. Later.